Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. My dear Pascal colleague, this is another lecture in the series of how to master vascular surgery, lecture number 10. And uh, the title of this lecture, how to get vascular uh, journals. Um, we will be speaking a lot about the Egyptian Knowledge Bank. My name is Dr. Muhammad Amr al I'm a consultant vascular surgeon. What is the importance of reading vascular journal? It's extremely important to be up to date with what is recent in the field of vascular surgery. It's also very important to join the global vascular conversation. Now, the global vascular conversation, which is moving in a lot of direction between uh, management of thoracic abdominal aortic aneurysm between frustrated and branched, and which type of bridges tend to be used, and what is a long term result. You need to join the global conversation and to know what is most recent in that regard. And uh, sometimes you look for uh, specific data in vascular surgery. For example, if you got a patient with Ehlers Danlos syndrome where you want to operate on him regarding either subclavian artery aneurysm or aortic aneurysm, you need to know what has happened in these cases, what is the best guideline, and if there's any recorded uh, vascular cases, same like what you are facing. It definitely will help you in vascular decision making. It's extremely important. Uh, and I will always advise <clears throat> uh, all my vascular colleagues to have a glimpse of at least two vascular journal on, on monthly basis. This is the uh, uh, Journal of Vascular Surgery, GVS, uh, and the European Journal of Vascular Endovascular Surgery. Uh, you need to uh, shuffle uh, quickly in them and uh, see what are uh, things that uh, are of interest to you and read it. And this is the absolute minimum. In a lot of cases, you need to go every week uh, to review these uh, cases. Now, the Egyptian Knowledge Bank is one of the best sources for uh, vascular journals, and uh, I will show over the next few minutes how you can do that. If we start to go to Google and uh, let us say you want journal of vascular surgery, a vascular surgery home page, if you click uh, on it, it will direct you to the home page of the journal of vascular surgery. Uh, but you cannot uh, read uh, journal of vascular surgery through this home page unless you are a member uh, of the journal and you pay the uh, the monthly fees uh, for having this registration so uh, gps uh, to access it you don't access uh, through this way uh, the better way that you can access it is through the egyptian uh, knowledge bank and uh, with the egyptian knowledge bank uh, you go to akb.com and you need to look in with your username and once you looked in with your username, these are the resources that you can, uh, you will have. And I'll just concentrate on two resources, on clinical key, this is very important, and on Elsevier. Uh, Elsevier. These two uh, great sources will, uh, will get you most of what you need regarding vascular journal. So let us start by clinical key. And when you open the clinical key, uh, you will be directed toward uh, this page, uh, clinicalkey.com. But uh, because you are going through the Egyptian Knowledge Bank, which have paid uh, the fees uh, to get an access to uh, its um, all its resources, that's why it will be very much beneficial. So here. I will say uh, I'm looking not for all types, I'm looking only for journals, I'm not looking for books, and I will mention here vascular. So I'm looking for vascular books. When you do that, it will get you papers uh, which mention uh, vascular topics. Uh, but this is not the, the best way to, to do. You need to go to browse, and I need to browse journals, this is a, another browsing tool which you should use. And you put in the search bar here, you don't put up there, you put it here, you put vascular. Now this will search all the vascular 
You can see here the annals of vascular surgery, the archive of uh, cardiovascular diseases, the cardiovascular um, uh, digital health. What is important to you, because you can see there is a huge amount of, of vascular journals. What I recommend you to do is GPS is a must. Journal of Vascular Surgery. And here you will find, uh, if you haven't logged in, you don't see anything inside. But I would advise you to uh, look in uh, here, if you press on this, and you need to look in. Once you look in, you created an account. And this account will help you to store the information, which means I will store that I need to read the American Journal of Vascular Surgery. So here you can see I have looked in. I need to put in the filter vascular. Again, press enter. And once you already looked in and you go vascular, you will get uh, a added benefit, which is here. So we'll go to the uh, Journal of Vascular Surgery here. You will see two things has been added. Here you can save. Uh, and I already saved it. You can save, so it will be saved with your uh, file that you saved the American Journal of Vascular Surgery. And here you can subscribe, it's already subscribed. So whenever there is a new issue of Journal of Vascular Surgery, you will get directed to your email. Now let us see how it looks like. When you open, you will go to same as the official website, but here you can have full access. For example, the last uh, edition, which is uh, 78, uh, you can see there is the issue 2 of August, which will be next month. This will be issued next month, and also you will see what is the next imprint, which has not been edited at all. Uh, here you can see all the uh, the magazine uh, comparing the best CLI with, with best uh, with basal trial 2, uh, abdominal aneurysm, you can actually read all article. And when you get this um, PDF file, you can download it and you can read it as well. So I would recommend you to have uh, the American Journal of Vascular Surgery. You need to save and you need to subscribe. This is very important. What also I like you to, uh, to have an access to is the, the vascular cases, uh, which uh, in the old days it was uh, it was called a journal of vascular uh, vascular cases, uh, which is this one. But I think it has stopped uh, at uh, 2016, and after that it became a journal of vascular surgery cases, innovation and techniques because we have added innovation technique and this is the one which is very uh, updated as well so when you go to journal of vascular surgery uh, vascular cases you can see uh, here is the last edition volume 9 and you can see this is the issue of September which is still in progress but you can see the option for June and for example, uh, I think in the uh, June issue, they were discussing a patient with Ehlers Danlos syndrome who have uh, abdominal aortic aneurysm. Uh, so uh, here it is, yeah. Open repair to abdominal aortic aneurysm in patient with vascular Ehlers Danlos syndrome. Uh, it's very nice uh, case to read and to manage and see how patient has has managed with Ehlers Danlos syndrome, what's the precautions, and you can download the file uh, quite quickly. So these are a very very helpful tool for you. Uh, you don't need to extend it. There is vascular pathology, there is vascular medicine. There is a huge amount of vascular, but I would advise you to start reading uh, these two magazines. So uh, let us go back again to the Egyptian Knowledge Bank and uh, let us go back again into this uh, the resources and here we'll go to Elsevier. We know that Elsevier have multiple options. Uh, we'll speak roughly about them. And now you have Elsevier Journal 
with collection of journals. You have textbooks, which we discussed in the previous issue. You have a Scopus database, and this is if you want to see uh, any author, how much paper he has published and what is the ranking. You use a Scopus database, very important. Clinical key already opened, and uh, also GeoFacet database, a very important database when you are using uh, machine learning and artificial intelligence. So you need to click this one which is the uh, Journal of Vascular Surgery as part of Elsevier. You can see it's a different platform. Elsevier is not clinical key. And you put your journal here. So, so let's just say uh, GBS uh, or Journal of Vascular. Um, you can see entry is not recognized because I put the abbreviation. Let us say Vascular. Here it is. You can see the annals of vascular surgery is there. Uh, European Journal of Vascular Endovascular Surgery, which have issued the European Journal of Vascular Endovascular Lymphatics and Venous. Here it is. The lymphatics and Venous Disorder is there. And the Journal of Vascular Surgery Cases, Innovation and Techniques. And the Journal of Vascular Surgery Access Devices which is also a very important journal. And you can search. So if we selected, uh, for example, European uh, Journal of uh, Vascular and Endovascular, here it is, Journal of Vascular Surgery, Venus and Lymphatics, and you go to search. And this will open uh, the, uh, uh, the web page uh, of that resources. And you can see, again, it looks a little bit different. But you can see here are the articles, and let us say that you want only year 2023. So you put that in the filter, and you can download any of the selected article, and you can export them into PDF as well. Uh, you can personalize your search in order that uh, I'm looking for a recent in English in specific topic, so you can have a personalized uh, search. You can look what is in press, very recent, it's not published yet, or in the last uh, four issues, or three issues, or two issues, and uh, you can select uh, a lot of uh, advantage in using filter in your uh, search. So, uh, Having said that, uh, I think these, the uh, Egyptian Knowledge Bank is an extremely useful uh, tool and I have shown how you can uh, use uh, search through the Egyptian Knowledge Bank if you go to Clinical Key and Elsevier, which I think you should do once every week in order to uh, get the most recent information. I hope uh, this is helpful to you in your fiscal career, which should be up to the notch, should be the best that is available. You should be fully aware with all the new technology. It will help you to your job. It will help you toward your patient. It will help you toward your team. And you will uh, become an eminent factor in your vascular team. And one of this essential tool is uh, to to be very up to date with all vascular journal. I wish you all the best and I hope this lecture to be of benefit to your career.